In this video, we'll explore powerful ways to consolidate, filter, sort, and summarize data using Excel's dynamic formulas. Let's jump in. Trick one, consolidate data from multiple sheets using VStack. We've got sales data in three sheets, quarter one, quarter two, and quarter three, all stored separately. Here's how to bring them all into one clean view using VStack. Just enter this formula, type equals VStack, then select the entire table from the first sheet. Go to the next sheet and select the table range, and then third sheet select table range, and press enter. All your sales data in one clean list, showing consolidated data appearing in real time. Finally, format the data and adjust the sales column headers. That's it. Next, trick two, consolidate with VStack plus dynamic filter plus sort by revenue. Here's how you can filter and sort sales like a pro. We've got three quarterly sales tables. Now let's combine them. Filter by revenue greater than $2,000. Let's begin with, just enter this formula. Type equals VStack then first select the table header, then comma. Now type I fairer with filter. Select the quarter one full range, and then apply the condition range. Greater than 2000. Then comma double quotes for error handling. Repeat the same. Next type I fairer with filter. Select the quarter two full range, and then apply the condition range greater than 2,000. Then again, I fairer. With filter, select the quarter three full range and then apply the condition range. Greater than 2,000. Close all brackets and press enter. This formula combines all three tables and includes only rows where revenue is greater than $2,000. It also includes error handling to avoid any blank output. Next, and sort the result by revenue. Copy the previous formula and paste it. Add the sort formula to arrange by highest revenue. To sort the result by the revenue column, sixth column, ascending order. In one formula, consolidated multiple data sets filtered high revenue records, sorted them from highest to lowest revenue. This is super handy for sales dashboards, performance summaries, and revenue reports, all automated and dynamic. Next, trick three, merge quarterly sales data and dynamically filter by region using a simple dropdown. Step one, let's start by creating a searchable dropdown to filter by region. Select cell E4, go to data, Data Validation, Choose List, in the source box, type North, East, South, West. Now you've got a dropdown that lists all regions. Ready to filter your data dynamically. Step two. Now let's combine all four tables and filter the data based on the selected region. In a new cell, enter this formula. Type equals filter, then inside it type VStack. Select the quarter one full range, then comma, select the quarter three full range, then comma, select the quarter three and four full range. Close the VStack, then type a comma, and again type VStack. This time, then select region column range, quarter one, quarter two, quarter three, Quarter four, close the VIA stack, then type equals select dropdown cell, close the filter function and press enter. Now, whenever you pick a region from the dropdown, Excel instantly shows the full records from quarter one to quarter four, all in real time with no manual effort. Perfect for region-based analysis, product inventory lookups, that's it. Here's our sales data set covering month, Q1, 
category, region, sales, profit, and orders. We'll extract summaries dynamically using only formulas. Category-wise summary. Let's break things down by category. This formula combines a header row with summarized data using VStack and HStack. It lists unique categories from column C. Then, by row with Lambda is used to calculate total sales, profit, and orders. For each category using some ifs, the result gives a quick summary of total sales, profit, and orders per category. Next, region-wise summary. Let's first summarize performance by region. This formula builds a summary table using VStack, starting with the header row directly from the table. Then we use HStack to place the data side by side. Unique lists all the distinct regions, and by row with Lambda calculates totals for each using some ifs. The result is a clear summary of total sales, profit, and orders for each region. Next, Category plus Region Combined Summary. Let's take it further. What if we want to see how each department performed in each region? In this formula, the LET function is used to define variables for better efficiency and readability. Kate Region Combo generates unique category region pairs using HStack and Unique. Then, by row with Lambda and some IFs calculates totals for sales, profit, and orders. Finally, VStack combines the header row with the summarized data created using HSStack. This results in a grouped summary of sales, profit, and orders for each unique category and region pair. Next, sorting the category plus region. Your report becomes cleaner and easier to scan. We'll sort first by category name and then by region name. This formula uses the LET function to organize the logic step by step. It first creates Kate Region Combo, a unique list of category and region pairs from columns C and D. Then, using by row with some ifs, it calculates sales, profit, and orders. These totals are combined side by side with HStack into combined data. The data is then sorted by category and region using the sort function. Finally, VStack adds a header row, so this gives us a neatly sorted summary of total sales, profit, and orders for each unique category and region combination. Next, Create a fully dynamic category summary based on a selected month from a drop-down list. First, add a drop-down for month using data validation. Select cell J33, go to the Data tab, Data Validation, choose List, and select the entire month column. Now here's the powerful formula that does it all at once. In this formula, summarizing data for a selected month using the LET function. Selected month pulls the value from drop-down cell to filter the data. Depth list generates unique categories column filtered by the selected month. Using by row with some EFs, calculate sales, profit, orders. The results are aligned side by side using HStack and VStack adds a header row. Change the month in the dropdown, and the entire summary refreshes instantly. And that's it. You've now learned how to consolidate multi-sheet data, filter and sort dynamically, build region and department-wise summaries, and create interactive monthly reports, all using just formulas. 
Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials.